Guys, back again another quick video to help you out. This time I'm taking the steering wheel airbag out of this 2016 Chevy Silverado and it's the same process for GMC Sierras as well um, in the 2016 era and the only thing you need to pull this airbag out is a flat tip screwdriver and I would suggest having two of them just because these things can be a bit of a pain if you get one side pop out a lot of times uh, if you don't hold it with a screwdriver in the corner when you pop the other side out it'll kick over and rehook on the other side then you have to do it all over again so it's just better to have two screwdrivers and obviously anytime you mess with airbags unless yours has already gone off you want to take the battery loose uh, on your negative terminal and leave it sit for a while Get that charge off there so you don't have these things going off if you're trying to replace your steering wheel or doing some other kind of work with your airbag off anyway quickly to show you how to take this off i've already got this removed and unhooked so i'll show you what you're trying to do here this wire that runs around the entire length of it of the back of the airbag that's what you're aiming for when you're trying to press in from the sides of the steering wheel uh, on the side of the steering wheel, you'll have these two little slots. Might be kind of hard to see, but they're kind of indented in there. Yours won't have a hole in it unless it's been replaced before. Uh, but you just take your flat tip screwdriver and you stick it in there, obviously. And these metal hooks right here are what's holding that spring clip around there. So you'll put your screwdriver in and you're trying to aim for this little area right here. Uh, it's a lot harder to do it when you're trying to get it started because you can't really see what you're doing and there's no way to look through the hole and like some other uh, models have that ability. But you're pressing in at that angle to catch that wire right on the side so you can press it in enough to pop that side out because these springs right here will press the airbag out when you've got that wire pushed in. But then take your, I have a small pry bar. I just stuck it in the other side and the seam between the airbag and the wheel and then went around and did the same on the other side. And then your airbag will pop out and you'll have two wire clips here, these two wire clips here. And you'll just pop this little orange clip out of the center of it you don't have to pull it all the way out, just pop it out enough that releases the clip and then you can pull your airbag out of your steering wheel and then you can do whatever you got to do. But uh, that's all there is to getting this out. It's, uh, it took me about 20 minutes to, to get the right angle on those wires to get it out of there. But it can be done at home, save you a lot of money. These airbags are very expensive uh, and to get them replaced in the shop, I'm sure even more expensive. So. If it saves you time and money and you like this video, go ahead and drop a like below and subscribe to my channel. I appreciate your time and good luck.